안녕하십니까 니콜라스 입니다 and today we are going to build a voice to code website the reason why is because how cool would it be if we could just program with our voice instead of using a keyboard so let's get started all right so for this project we're going to be using only vanilla javascript and we're going to be using the speech recognition api that the browsers have especially the one that google chrome has so this is only 30 lines of code but over here this is the website that we're going to be doing our proof of concept on. So when I click start listening, this thing is going to start listening to me. I will speak to this microphone and hopefully we will see the results on my console. So let's do it. Click start listening. Hello, testing from planet Earth. Wow, this is very, very accurate. And also, if you didn't know, you can change the language of the recognition engine. 안녕하세요. 오늘은 삼겹살을 먹고 싶어요. Wow, this thing understands my shitty Korean. That's amazing. But what we can do is we can dictate something like HTML open div or CSS style background color blue. Something like this is possible, okay? So I'm going to come up with those sort of commands and we're going to test them and we're going to see if that idea could become true, okay? So HTML open header. No, we have a problem. Header, header. HTML open header. HTML open H1. HTML close H1. CSS open body. CSS open body. CSS close. CSS close. No! Oh! All right, so as you can see, I cannot speak English and I cannot say the word close. So we're going to be using HTML open something, HTML finish something, and that's it, all right? CSS style background color is blue. CSS style width is 25 pixels. No, no, not width. Width, width is 25 pixels. No, not width. Ah. With. 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 So, uh, everything seems to be working fine. I think this idea might work just a little bit, except that I cannot speak English properly and this thing doesn't understand the word close and with, with, whatever, whatever. Okay, so we're going to try to do like a if else. All right, so that's it, it's, it's working. Now we have to actually understand the commands and I'm going to try to output HTML and CSS. Okay, so this was easier than I thought, actually. And all I have to do is basically say the sentence with the same structure, and I just break the sentence in pieces. Hopefully, what I can do is show you here that the CSS is being created, and it will hopefully affect how the website looks, okay? CSS open body. CSS style, background color is blue. CSS style, color is white. CSS style, font size is 25 pixels. CSS finish. CSS open button. CSS style, background color is green. CSS style, font size is 25 pixels. CSS style, color is white. CSS style padding is 20 pixels. CSS style display is block. CSS style margin bottom is 20 pixels. CSS finish. This is so cool. <laughs> oh my God, that's amazing. Now the last piece of the puzzle is to create and inject the HTML. All right, see you soon. Almost done. All right, I'm done. The HTML part is finished and it wasn't that hard. So let's get started. Three, two, one. 
HTML Open H1. HTML Content. Hello, welcome to my website. HTML Finish H1. Yes, it works. HTML Open H3. HTML Content. This is a small title. HTML Finish H3. Yes, let's do CSS. La 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 la. La 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 la. Okay. CSS open H1. CSS style color is pink. CSS finish. CSS open H3. CSS style color is tomato. CSS finish. CSS open body. CSS style background color is blue. CSS finish. Awesome! CSS open body. CSS style font size is 25 pixels. CSS finish. CSS open button. CSS style background color is blue. CSS style background color is purple. CSS style color is white. CSS style display is block. CSS style margin bottom is 35 pixels. CSS style padding is 30 pixels. CSS style border radius is 40 pixels. Oh, even it even got border radius. That's it for this video. But I mean, I'm happy with what we just did. This is so cool. 75 lines of code, 75 lines of vanilla JavaScript code. And we did a voice to code application. I know it's very basic, but still, Vanilla JavaScript is super powerful. We didn't need any framework or whatever. So if you're interested in learning Vanilla JavaScript with me for free, then check out the link on the description. Thank you so much for watching as always. Don't forget to be happy today. Don't forget to eat kimchi. Kamsamnida. Saranheo. I'm super happy right now. Bye-bye.